Okay, so now once you get your skates on, the most common skill that most people want to know is how to stop. Uh, and almost immediately, so can you get your skates on? I want to learn how to stand up and I want to stop. So we got the stand up part down. Now we're going to learn how to utilize that rubber thing that's hanging off the back of your skate called the brake. Uh, so you've got your stride, so you're going to do a push push. And then I'm going to break the step down into three different steps. So once you get into your stride, you're going to break it off into a coast and stagger your feet, breaking foot forward, left foot back, and then pulling up your toe so that that brake now hits the ground and then you're going to apply the pressure to be able to stop. And I'll show you just how we do it here. Simple stop. Now, quick part about that stop, I want you to understand where your weight's gonna be. So that when you're in this stop, applying the pressure, you're gonna know where you should be standing, how you should be standing, because most people look at this, it looks easy, but it, you have to really pay attention to a lot of different elements. Uh, one of those basic elements is make sure those feet are closer together in a center line. Uh, and I'll, I'll aim to you, this is what I'm talking about. You can either be wide, in this case, you wanna be close. The closer they are, the more of a center line you have, the more you pull that stop off, okay? That's real important. Now, when you're standing side, I'm gonna show you the side angle where your weight should be when you pull it off. So when you stagger your weight, your feet, your weight should be on the back foot, in this case, my left foot, so that I can pull the toe of my right foot up to apply that break. If my weight's on the right foot, I can't pull that toe up as easily. So shift the weight to the back, pull up the toe, and then you get your basic stop. 